Well, hello, hello, and welcome to Resident Evil Revelations. Uh, we played the first game, the two second game remake. We played the original third Nemesis, and we just finished a Code Veronica X. And I think chronologically, it's time for this game. <clears throat> I, I played four last year, so I'm not gonna play four again. Um, so yeah, I never played this game, I never watched it. I watched it some bits here and there, but I don't know much about the story or anything. So, this is basically a blind playthrough, and here we go. I did play Revelations too, so I think the whole um, uh, episodes and uh, the whole format is gonna be the same. Now, my question is, should I play this controller? Or with keyboard and mouse. Because I'm not sure if there's a lot of like aiming and shooting. I know it's third person, right? Let me start with controller and then I will continue with uh, mouse if I feel like I need to aim better. Resident Evil Revelations. Yeah, the game is a little bit low. Auto save feature. Oh. Uh, campaign episode one into the depths. Let me check the options very quickly. Controls, game settings, browser color red, display tutorial, display subtitles, map display. Okay, display settings, brightness, audio. Background music and FS effects, voices, chat volume, okay. Video settings. I believe this game was launched originally to for Nintendo DS, 3DS, maybe? Something like that. And then it was ported as a all the other platforms. 1080p frame rate 60. Yeah, this looks fine to me. Here we go. <clears throat> uh, this is a Resident Evil Revelations Episode 1 into the campaign. New game. We're gonna play normal. And those enemies in the background, they look like the... What were they calling Resident Evil 4? Oh, here we go, intro. Six PM Mediterranean Sea. What year? Hey G. So apparently that's Jill, very new model. Not a fan of it, but whatever. Long hair. Incredible. The Queen Zenobia. This thing is lucky to be afloat. Take us around. Let's find a boarding point. Mysterious boat, Queen Zenobia. It's a ghost ship. There's a few movies about ghost ships, yeah, and they're fun. The BSSA, BSAA. So Chris is here in this ship, and Jessica, which I don't know who she is. Right, so I can 
Uh, who's this guy? They didn't, they didn't say his name or anything. Mele, aim. The aim is kind of nice, to be honest. And then camera. Camera is a bit rough. It's like fixed angles, but oof, I'm not a fan of this camera at all. Let me try it with mouse and keyboard. I'll play with control, I think. It's like kind of tank controls, but I don't swear. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> controls, man. Why is the camera like? Automatically, automatically looks looks that way. Whatever. I might be able to shoot it off. Jill, you are the master of unlocking. You should lockpick that, not shoot it. The hell. I guess they're teaching us how to play again. So that's to that's to shoot and that's to reload. Okay. Oh shit. The stench. It's been abandoned for a while. Crew's dead. I did this to them. Ugh, it smells like rotting flesh. I can smell it through my screen. Man, the camera in this game is atrocious. What the hell? Oof. Like, I wish the camera was like, instead of like this, it was like... Mm, not so much, but you guys... It looks up, like, on its own. It's whatever. No signs of life. Something's here. Hey. What? What happened? I don't think we're alone. Also, the voice of Jill is so weird. Can I inspect that? Okay, can you stop giving me a prop and then stop that it? Doesn't look like just water. Oh, let's continue. Sorry about that. Oh. So, do you just run automatically in this game, I guess? That is not like sprint button or anything? Yeah, cool. coming from the ducks oh sir you have a inflammation on your hand uh, arm it's arm i had never seen a mutation like this um... no power which means no elevator for us okay this is blocked, so we can only go this way. Let's go. It's not working. I mean, this is the alien. Anyone hiding here? Otacon? Oh, we got that green hair. How did you open your inventory though? Oh, there you go. Menu. Green herb. Handgun ammo. So you have items, ammunition, key items, and a uh, map. Wow. Very simplified. Game model, basic controls. Run by pushing L3, okay. 
uh, strafe, left trigger, do a quick turn, shoot, reload, switch weapons, sub weapon controls, use that weapon with Y. Switch weapons, okay. Health recovery, press speed to use a green hair. Evade. While the right timing right before enemy attacks will let you evade attacks. Pressing. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Physical attacks. You can use a physical attack when you are near a staggering enemy and when X is displayed on the screen. This is like Resident Evil 4. Kicks. Hold X to charge a power for an extra hard hit. Good for saving on ammo. Menu. Okay, so... Yeah. Fucking rats, man. <laughs> it's shorted out. They ate the cables. The power still works here. Oh yeah. Nice texture, bro. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Can I have a coffee? Oh yeah. Give me that. So far I feel like this this is like Resident Evil Arcade. Very simplified. Ugh, the face is smashed in completely. What is this? Jill, take a look at this. What? Parker, give me a hand here. Sure, no problem. What is that? A scanner or something? I got something. A metal detector. I think it's a gun. Now what? Give me a sec. So it's not Chris. So <laughs> regenerator. Okay. Creep with all me, I guess. Did I shoot it on the arms? Oh, what a dodge. That was sick. Pick it. Boom. What is this enemy? This explains our missing crew. This is not good. Where are you, Chris? Okay, that was a prologue, I guess. Episode 1, Into the Depths. Here we go. I had to do something? Oh, I had to press the button. Okay, so... This sunny and idyllic Mediterranean coast was the site of one of the world's greatest structures. 
It took a full 11 years to finish constructing the world's first Aquapolis, the floating city of Terra Grigia. A sustainable metropolis operating on a massive solar energy matrix and equipped with the latest green technologies. Never before had solar energy been used to supply power to an entire city. But in 2004, Veltro, a terrorist group opposing the city's development, launched a bioterrorist attack. Uh oh. They not only released a virus, but also several creatures, known as bioorganic weapons, further complicating the situation. This launched one of the worst tragedies the world has ever seen. The FBC, the world's leading counter bioterror organization operating under the auspices of the U.S., was called in to direct efforts to contain the attack. The BSAA, a counter bioterror NGO, which operates independently of the interests of any one country, went in as observers to assist the FBC. Realizing the need for immediate and decisive action, Supreme Local Headquarters issued the order to use the city's solar energy matrix on itself. Oh. Media outlets around the world began to refer to the incident as the Terra Grigia Panic. Following the incident, the FBC announced it has successfully disbanded the terrorist group called Veltro. It is now 2005, and a sense of calm and security is finally returning to the people. But, as you can see, the lost city of Terra Grigia remains inaccessible. Mm. A silent and potent symbol of the threat that bioterror poses for people around the world. Why was the reason for attacking them, though? In the first place. We don't know. Maybe they were working for Exxon. So this is the report here. Ah, there you two are. O'Brien, you don't normally join the fray. Well, my doctor told me I need exercise. <laughs> I assume you both know that the FBC has cordoned off the entire area. However, in the past few weeks, a number of mysterious carcasses have washed up. I guess the FBC couldn't cover up a mess this big, huh? Anyone who knows what happened here is going to put two and two together. And that's why I've sent the BSAA in to investigate. Did you pick up your new equipment from Quint? Yeah. Genesis or something. Is that its name? You didn't bother to read the manual, did you? No, uh, I brought it with me, <laughs> just in case. I hope you read quickly, because you're going to need it on your mission. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm on it. Bro, so many names to achieve for. I'll, I'm going to try to keep up with everything. So, uh, Genesis Manual, version 1. The nickname of a high-level bioscanner currently being tested and developed by Global Pharmaceutical Consortium. It advances special synchrotron radiation of a target in order to analyze it. Viral analysis. It is possible to detect and analyze even the smallest amount of viruses. Okay. Vaccine manufacturing. It is impossible to produce simple vaccines from, from viral analysis data. Okay. Detection. Using synchrotron radiation, it is possible to detect specific objects. <clears throat> Their data for bullets, medicinal herbs, are registered within the internal memory of testing. If a detectable object is nearby, the indicator in the lower right area of the monitor will light up. So... Okay. Where are we going? They're gonna have to... Ah, just... look at this mess. Oh, they're rotted to hell. You're gonna teach us how to scan? Skin so pale. I've never seen anything like it. Use the Genesis to get a reading on it. RB. The Genesis requires a decent sample size to get an accurate reading. Twelve percent. Scan the carcasses on the beach and send me your data. Ugh. So we have to scan everything around. 
That's a yikes. Have a look at this. So is this before or after we went to the to the boat? Oh man, we're farming. I'm getting something. metal detected. I'm inside it. Careful now. Don't worry. I've done this before. Who needs a mask? Who needs a suit? Protection? Biohazard? Anything? Viruses. Am I right? Hello, Polygon. Let's say go. I've got something. What is this? If it's an engineered mutation, this could prove a link. I'll run some tests on this. Continue with the investigation. Is it me or the game polling is a little bit low? Ah. Oh. Virus does not exist there, a conspiracy. True. Yeah, welcome. Sorry, I was distracted a little bit by the cinematic. So how much ammo I have? Do I need to find the 100%? Oh. The oh, fuck! Careful, you two. Not only you. Okay, we're shooting blobs now. What the fuck? I, I hope I don't have to take care of that guy. Shoot his mouth! How tanky is this guy, man? Okay. After Raccoon City, this must be a cakewalk. I suppose. So why'd you quit the FBC for this outfit? I wanted to be more involved. I wanted to fight. I see you two are okay. Continue with the investigation, but proceed with extreme caution. Okay. How is the game volume? Polion, if you don't mind telling me. <clears throat> We already got this one. Hmm. We need more samples to run an analysis. Give me a few this is good, you think? I don't pay you to play. I pay you to work. This feel is a little bit low. Can I open this? Won't open. I think something is jamming it. Okay, can I let me see. We don't have enough data to run a complete. No, we need to go gather some more samples for forward maybe. Beach. Find more blobs to scan. Oh man, I'm really not a fan of this mechanic. That's gonna be alive, isn't it? Fucking hell! Are you serious? Well, that smell must have ruptured from gas. It farted. Christ, what a mess. Compared to Mike, yes. Let me put the game a bit louder. Like that, okay. So, guys, if you see a dead whale on a, on a shore or anything, do not get close. Because from the decomposition, all the bacteria inside, after being dead, they hold a lot of gas inside, and they can literally explode like a fucking C4 and kill you. By the way. Just like that happened to Jill now, but it might end up 10 times stronger. So, yeah. Be careful. <laughs> a grenade. Sub weapon controls. Very right, that bro. Very right, that bro. What is this? FPC. Looks like someone already traded the place. Okay, but where are they though? Okay. I need one more. Do you guys see one more blob around? Because I don't. I thought it was uh, Sir Stone was. Uh, I thought it was how Sir Stormy was made. But, like the whale thingy exploding. Okay, we found everything. 
all these textures. What was that? Collected enough samples. Good. Get them to me ASAP. A mania popped off and I didn't touch any button, I just went away. Let's go back to O'Brien. Okay. Is there... These are literally bullet sponges. Ha! Why is that right there? Day's work for you two, eh? All right, enough chit chat. Get that sample data to me. Not really a fan of that comment this guy made about Raccoon City, like tri trivializing the thingy. Oh, you already been there, right? Yeah, sure. Also, so I guess they had the Jill from PS1. Uh, was there any Jill games for PlayStation 2? Is everything okay? Bring this in. Yo, give me a second, bro. Is there any GL games from PS2? I don't think so. So it jumped from PS1 to PS3 to like this. Because they updated the model and then they updated the model again for the remake. And then you have on the last movie, you have the GL from the remake on the last uh, Resident Evil movie. But yeah, you have GL on the movies like this too. I think there's one or two. What do you want, bro? There you are. Nice work. No doubt about it. These corpses show signs of viral infection. And I bet it's no coincidence they came through the FBC's blockade. Well, we did all we can. Now, we wait for the results to come back from HQ. Huh? It's the emergency line. Yeah, it's me. Uh-huh. What? Yes, that's fine. I'll take it from here. We'll have to speed things up. Starting now. Uh huh. Good. Get to it. Do we trust this guy, guys? Jill, Parker. You two are still on the case. What happened? We lost contact with Chris and Jessica. So this is before I ran into the boat. How? This is Parker. I've sent their last known coordinates to your terminals. The signal was lost over the ocean. I thought they were in the mountains chasing Feltro. But judging from their position, they must be on a ship. I'll go back to HQ, take charge of the search and rescue. You two will be my eyes out there. Yes, sir. Yeah, I was talking about a plane outbreak with Tamon, but I'll, I'll, I will not know how to set it up, to be honest. And it doesn't have any main character, like, sure, it's fun, it must be a fun game to play Raccoon City Outbreak on Cobb. I have watched Outbreak uh, 1 and 2. <clears throat> but, yeah, uh, used to play myself, I don't know. I'll just try to play the mainline games. I guess we can save. I don't really need to save. Walk it. 100% accuracy. S rank. Uh, back here. You think these things got to Chris and Jessica? I hope not. Hey. No one's saying Chris is dead. Alright. Then let's find him already. What is that dialogue? <laughs> Is that the lock? I'll check it out. Okay. I'll see what I can find here. Copy that. I'll radio you if I pick up Chris's trail. Well, we're splitting already. Hello? Not a huge fan of that zombie or whatever you want to call it design. Looks like a dead end. Let's go up here then. 
do I not have a flashlight or something? Let's split up for safety, exactly. If I have any problems, I cannot deal with an enemy, you will cover my ass, right? Gabba? Should I make the game darker? I'm not sure if it's bright now or it will get darker later, but I'm gonna make it slightly, slightly. Darker. Oh shit. So our flashlight is automatic. Yeah. I hear something. Oh shit! Run. Oh my god. Bro. Camera in this game is a little bit troll. You see, critical shot if you hit them on the head. And they just become <laughs> dead. Can I scan them? Okay. I don't have many bullets. How do I see my health? I don't know. Oh man, this camera. I'm trying to like not move too fast so you guys can also see. But holy shit. How you play this game yourself, Polygon? Or watched it? Or this is like your first time? Just like me. First time. This place is a mess. No documents, nothing. Looking for herpes. Or ammo. Your first time? Nice. So we are back here. There is a room downstairs that I have checked. There is a cold draft coming from outside. No shit. It's locked. There is an anchor mark on the door. Okay. It's locked. Scream. So Chris with with someone named Jessica. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh well. I think she's dead. Is that like a sheep uh, survivor or is that Jessica? Fucking freaks shooting the booty. Oh man. That guy said I only have six bullets, guys. Can I knife this guy? Okay. Head shot. Kick him. Oh! Got him. What's going on? I found a survivor. The BOW's got her, though. Who was she? I'm still trying to piece that together. Okay. Give me this. Metal Gear Solid 2 vibes with the, the ship and the tank and everything. Yeah, I can see that. The colors. 
I mean, the camera is different, but yeah. Well, there is nothing that could identify her. Let's see what the Genesis can tell me. Nice suit. The hell? Target not found. That's... That's... That's what the Genesis tells me. Oh, what is this? Item found. What? What? You have to scan for items? Bro. That is a troll. So I had to look around the room like this. Handprint. With the scanner. Item found. What? Guys, I don't like this mechanic. We already scanned this, right? Oh, never mind. So you have to reveal the items. That's why the game is called Revelations. Ah! Not fine. That sucks. I mean, if it's a game for Nintendo DS, I get it. It's like an extra gimmicky mechanic. For PC, what the fuck? Bro, Jill, the item. A crew quarters area key. Parker, I couldn't find anything out on the woman, but I did find a key. Copy that. Hold on to it. We just might need it. Okay. Um, the crew. <laughs> that was cool. Not a fan of this enemy design, but whatever. Oh, the shot in the dick. We found him! Oh, we can open this now. Huh? Hello? Oh. Bro. That guy just spawned there, okay? Can you get stunned? I wanna fucking punch you. Ouch. Bro, that's so lame. So you cannot see your health and then when it goes like red it means you're low hp okay interesting and then apparently when you kill them they're like this blob this organic mass that decomposes uh, i guess it can make sense because yeah i don't want to get into the whole talk to be honest <laughs> so we have to just scan the room Yikes. One hand grenade. Let's see if it was worth it. Five bullets. Another five bullets. And a green hair. Alright, that was worth it. Because that basically paid off for what it took me to kill this guy. Okay, so we're gonna have to scan every freaking room in the game. Yikes. <clears throat> Let's go back. To Chris. Jill, you can jump that. Come on. You can jump through those boxes. Come on, you're a super cop. Oh shit. Oh shit. Can this guy come up? It's like the core of the game, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna use my grenade to just see how they work, okay? Boom. That's how it works. Hey, we got a complete scan. Let me scan this room. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Aha! Bro. At what? Oh, I cannot carry more ammo? Are you telling me Jill has look at look at her look at her suit. She has this suit with all these pockets for magazines and stuff and oxygen and carrying shit. But I can only carry 40 bullets. Okay, okay. Did you say so? Oh hello there. Yeah, that was quick. That was quick. So, what is the point of getting this? Uh, so, below my camera, you can see that three. Every time we get 100% scan completion, we get one of those pills. What are these for? Are they necessary or? What is this? Okay, more ammo. Um, there was another room we never checked. Also, I'm guessing there cannot be items in the middle of the corridor, right? I'm not gonna be scanning everything, man. Let's go back. This room? Oh, never mind. Back here. Jill. Come on. We gotta help Chris. Oh, so Chris is on this room. It was locked before. Okay, cool. Oh, Chris. he's a prisoner. Chris? That's not Chris. What is this? Veltro. Oh, it's a trap! He's a trap! It's a trap! <laughs> you guys have oxygen masks, don't you? That was episode one into the depths and i guess that's the guy who's uh, appeared on the news before with the veltro terrorist attack it's time we learn the truth guys i don't care i don't care all right let's go next episode Previously on Resident Evil Revelations. We lost contact. Are we watching this? Summarize story plots. Recaps. Nah, we just play this, right? No signs of life. But I feel like something's here. I think it's a gun. In previous episode. Man, it feels more like a playing a movie than a video game. But that's they try this. Uh, they try this uh, formula with Revelations one and two, do like an episodic release instead of like a full game. Oh, great. Back in yeah, back in the last decade, there, there were a lot of games who tried that formula. There were a lot of games who tried the the episodic. Your thumb feels strange. Why? Episode two, double mystery. Mountains in Europe, in general, you know, like mountains in Europe. <laughs> Sniper. Slow down, Chris. Oh, we're playing. There, oh, we're Jessica now. Or Chris. So. My feet are killing me. Our 
source indicates the Oof. camp is on the far side of this peak. So that's again, that is the new Chris. Okay. The airplane is the new Chris. Do you guys remember Chris from Cold Veronica? We just finished. It was like it was uh, thin and strong. But this guy is fucking buffed as fuck. But look at this guy. Can't make contact with HQ. Who'd have out of the stuck circuit? out here for so long? Okay, so Jessica is a new character in the series, right? And then we're playing as Chris Redfield. Holy! It's kind of cold here, you know? So we have a pistol and a shotgun. Okay. We have a sea source. Very handy. And ice pickaxe. Oh, trembling. Oh, shit. Oh, a plane. My God, it crashed. There shouldn't be any shipping routes in this area. And the intel we got on Veltro was on the money. Come on. So were they after this plane? Because she said the plane, not a plane. I don't know. I hope this story explains a little bit later. Jesus. No one could have lived through that. Maybe the parachute. Investigate the site. Let me know if you find anything. Search the crash site. Oh, so lucky. So lucky this this is intact. My god, it crashed. I mean, Jessica, I just saw it in front of my hands, you know. <laughs> well, thank you. On handling the new prototype, there will be a new prototype introduced in this mission. All missions participants are urged to use extreme caution. When handling the special prototype, all instructions by the handler, handler must be followed to the letter. In the event of an emergency, follow the contingency guidelines in the hazards and emergency manual. Once the prototype's ability have activated, it will be impossible to control them. The proscribed sedative must be administered every hour during transport. While it, while it is possible to control the special prototype, its behavior in the field cannot be accurately predicted. When control is no longer viable, please contact HQ on the dedicated line. So it sounds like a tyrant. It sounds like they were carrying a bioweapon. And he's free! He was here! <laughs> Smart with the biohazard symbol. And you open it. Of course. Some faint traces of a virus here. And I have a scanner too. Chris has the Genesis. Do you really think we're dealing with Veltro again? Hard to say. I find it difficult to believe they survived Terra Grigia though. That's a big one. He's alive! Okay, so I need to find more of those, I guess. Then scanning the game. Oh shoot! The pilot! Of course, he's wearing a ba ba black ha baklava. He's a terrorist. He might have been Beltro. I better use the Genesis. Yeah. Item found. Picked up the flight plan. The manifest should give us a lead to work with. Let's see. They were headed for Falcoin and Mock Airport. If that's where they are, this mine should take us there. Go through the mine. Okay. Oh shit. We got some Resident Evil 4 mechanics. Oh man. I'll tell me. So we're going into a mine. We're in the mountains and suddenly we're going to mines. Okay. Okay, Jessica, game. I need a hand. Hold on. We're just gonna be like a little bit of cop here. Not cop, but AI cop. Oof. You should have worn your thermal underwear. Hey, did you hear that? No. Thermal underwear, Chris. This is why you came to Europe to meet the girls. Hello? 
Oh, hello guys. What the fuck are you? What the hell? Is this enemy? Uh, you take care of that one. This guy trusts you. <laughs> what is this enemy, man? This is Devil May Cry. What the fuck? Looks that way, doesn't it? Then Veltro is back from the dead. Are these yeah. despawn? And we have to stop them before anyone gets hurt. Enemies despawn, guys. They just disappear. Shotgun shells. Well, I'm switching to the shotgun. Fuck this shit. Boom. Well, let's explore. Miss scan, guys. We need to scan everything. Target not found. She's an alien. <laughs> the scanner doesn't detect her. It's a human. These enemies are very lame. Boom. What's up, boys? Scan them before it despawns. No. <laughs> okay. Raise Giga Chad. Should I go that way? Can I climb this? Oop. Uh, I don't trust this bridge. This goes back. This goes back to. Oh, hello, guys. What the fuck? Enemies takes two bullets. What is this? BOW decoy, a grenade type sub weapon. Once it hits the ground, it lets out a unique. It lets out a unique sound that lures the surrounding enemies and then explodes, taking out everything in the vicinity. Very effective if used correctly. So it's like a pipe bomb. In Left 4 Dead. Wait, let me see. So I have this weapon and then that weapon. Okay. Uh, should I go down there? Oh shit. That's a big dog. Huh? Oh wow. Get it off me! Get it off me! Get it, Jessica. Nice shot. That's a lot of enemies. Boom. That's how you use it. That's how you do it. I guess I should heal, right? Well, that's so lame. I, I understand they're trying new things. It's not going to be like all residuals are going to play the same way. And not having to access the menu is also... It's different. It's new, I guess. What, what what did we find there? An item or something? This one. Oh, that's nice. So I'm guessing I go this way, right? So, Jill, was it? It was what? Stay focused. She was your partner before, right? Yeah, my partner from before. What about it? I was, you know, just asking. Mm-hmm. Just asking, huh? <laughs> Your partner? Do they mean their partner as a, like, work? Or, like, more than that? I'm not sure. Because there's... I'm not sure if it's confirmed Chris and Jill had a relationship, or... It's more like a theory. I'll take it. What is... 
She's going ahead of me. Oh no! Oh shit. Poor me, Jessica, you have a sniper. Oh no. Can I move? It's just my leg. I'm not going anywhere for a while. I gotta move, guys. Oh shit. Cannot use my shotgun. Only my pistol. Hello guys. Alright, these guys are very squishy. Only take two bullets. Damn, there's too many of them. Hang in there, Chris. Oh, shit, my ammo's not gonna last. I mean, yeah, are you sure about that? Me and my sweet ass are on the way. Oh shit. Oh wow. That's a big boy. Oh my god, there's so many wolves. This guy keeps calling more. This guy's stronger, right? Oh, Jessica's here. We're safe. Jessica's here, guys. Shoot something, Jessica! For fuck's sake. Wow, she one shot that one. Nice. Yeah, I don't run out of the bomb, actually. Oh, fuck! Ouch. I'm gonna use that shit. Too many. Can that damage me? Game, how long are we gonna do this? I'll be okay. <sighs> I'm gonna heal. Sorry to bring this up again, but bring what up? Do you trust me as much as Jill? There's no need to compare. I trust you both. Besides, trust is built through actions, not words. Oh! That's so like you, Chris. It's always about the job, isn't it? Okay. Who put this ladder here? So convenient. <laughs> she keeps asking about that. Jessica, what is she? She's distracted. I mean, if I had Chris next to me, <laughs> I'll be distracted too, you know? Holy. Oh, shit. Un segundo. Ah. Keep going. They made it out of the mines. Look, is that the airstrip? That's their hideout. Okay. Another plane. This is Forkball. Do you read? Chris here. I read you, sir. Are you all right? Where are you? The interference here killed our signals. We're at Valcoin and Mock Airport. Damn it. It's all a setup. What do you mean? I sent Jill and Parker to the Mediterranean on faulty intel, and now I've lost contact with them. I haven't heard from them since. What the hell? Hell going on Chris you better look at this it's impossible O'Brien you're not gonna like this we found the Veltro crest then stories of their resurrection are true if that's the case then then the setup that got Jill and Parker it was all yeah, a trap I'd almost guarantee it O'Brien, we'll go after Jill and Parker. I hope that's not a problem. Oh. Not at all. 
Make your way to the Mediterranean. So we were rescuing Chris, and now Chris is gonna rescue us. Let's go. Any idea what's going on? We'll sort it out later. We have to move. Okay, you're not gonna go into that base or anything. You can dodge while reloading. 8.30 p.m. guest cabin. Okay, so we have been kidnapped. What? Where? Parker. Where are you? I don't know. A room, I think. Somewhere on the ship. Damn it. Bastard took all my weapons. Can you reach HQ? No. Comms are out, it seems. We should regroup. Are they both... How do they both have communications? Already? Maybe they're playing a sick game with them. Where am I? Bro, you push things with a button, not even. Still on. Do I have my knife? I don't have my knife. I don't have a pistol either. I don't have the scanner. I don't have anything. Use my hands and legs to kick. It's locked. What is this? Screw the uh, pretty tight. Okay, so we need a screwdriver. Bro, I just pushed this. Hello again? Maybe I have to push it twice. Ooh! It's filled with dirty water. There might be something at the bottom. This is so Resident Evil 1. It's rusted. Maybe they are making a little uh, tribute to the first game. Of course, it's on the toilet. Been rugged for a while. Oh, hello. How do I evade? Press L or T plus A with the right timing right before enemy attacks will let you evade the attack. Okay. <laughs> okay, bro. Okay, bro. Nice one. Got him. Am I right? Is that a puzzle time? What do I have to do here? What? Okay. Oh, this guy's coming back. I hope you can not open doors. I'm gonna ammo, but I don't have any guns, bro. Oh, hello. Rule 301. Hot luck. I wish I had my weapons. Bro, this dodge is so lame because you can like spam it kinda. Jill, you can't fight without a weapon. Just do your best to dodge. This is kind of a recreation of the mansion, isn't it? Trying to find a weapon. That, that reminds me of like amnesia, kind of. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm going. Oh shit, the shotgun. Oh, we're gonna leave. We cannot leave the room after taking it, right? A shotgun. That will be useful. There is a place to insert something. Yeah. Hmm. There is something unsettling about the waves. The music in the background is very quiet. Yeah. 
Let me get past him before he attacks me. I do not think they can cross doors. So. Hello, any pistol? Man, I left a I left a room behind. I hope it was not that one. Oh, hello. Be quiet, chill. He's eating. Oh, shit. <laughs> so quiet. Okay, I like my no weapons survival time, to be honest. Wait, so we went that way. We explored that whole wing. Let's go downstairs, I guess. Ooh, meat. Let's have some uh, dinner. This looks like the exit at the end of the, the chapter or something. A helm mark. Bro, who builds this? Look at this. Who the fuck builds this? Can I pick more handgun? I feel like I should have my handgun by now, you know? Because the game is giving me... Oh, hello. Parker! Okay? I'm fine, but the ship's crawling with BOWs. Okay. We're going to need our weapons. I think I saw them on my way here, but I couldn't reach them. We should be okay as long as we work together. Okay, bro. As long as we work together. Don't leave me. There are more creatures this way. I found this though. Think we can use it? Yeah, it just might do the trick. Hell yeah, brother. Let's see. Let's lure them. The weapons I found are just up ahead. Boom! Gaming. We're gaming, guys. Bro, I dodged that, but okay. Let's throw it there so both go for it. Can they hit me? I dodged that. I'm just trying to go to my weapons, bro. <clears throat> Let's just get the weapons first. E. What is this? I custom, custom parts. Okay. Magazine. No, I'd win in Italy. Holy, there's a lot of weapons. What is this? An item box? You can equip or switch weapons on this screen. There is no item box in this game. Hello, my there, welcome. You can also customize weapons if you have custom parts. Any weapon you obtain will be automatically added to this screen. Use X to switch screens and change the custom parts. Okay. Custom part damage one. So, wait. I can carry through weapons, and then how do I... How do I put the... Oh, custom parts. There you go. Damage 10%. Welcome, how are you? Sir? Now we contact HQ and tell them what the hell is going on. Hell yeah. Let's go. Head for the bridge. Bro, 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 bro. This is the room I was stuck. Help me! By the way, what's the deal with that guy in the gas mask? What's his game? 
I love how characters act like stupid just for the sake of exposition and explaining the plot to the player. But like you can do that if you do it well. But this is too too obvious. You know, it's like it's for dummies. Exposition for dummies. Anything else in this room? Can I open this? A fridge! I want my food! Oh, let's see what's in this room. I found organic matter. Let's go back. So this is where we started? No. This is where he started, maybe. And he got out of the room with the puzzle. That's a cool detail. That is a cool detail. Okay, let's check this room. We never check this room. It's locked from the other side. On the other side. Okay. Hello, boys. Okay. What the fuck? I think this guy was hit by the bomb before and he was low HP. Never mind. Maybe it was that one. Bro, I want to kick them. When they get stunned, you know? Whatever. I'm just killing them to scan. The only problem with that is I run out of ammo, right? It's okay. There's a lot of ammo ahead, I think. Oh, green hair. Nice. No boys. Get that. Boom. If you scan them when they're alive, do you get more... Maybe you get more percentage. Is that a new mechanic? Hmm. So we came through there. What is this way? Oh, this way is locked. A car reader. So we need a car. You cannot find items in the corridors, right? Okay. Oh my god, you can. Holy fucking shit. Two stone parts? Bro, am I gonna have to scan every room and the hallways? What is Raccoon City what? What is that? No. Can I heal? Bro, can you shoot him? Parker! Bro, you are fucking useless. <laughs> guy's just looking at me. I want to kill him. He reloads. Nice. What is a Doom map archive? So there's a Raccoon City map in Doom? Is that what you're saying? That cool. Let's get all this ammo. And now we have to go back upstairs and check the other rooms. Oh, i never seen this. So the anchor mark again. And this... Wait. Oh, okay. That's that door. Okay. And then... Oh, we go this way now. We need to find a key card or the anchor key. Also, let, let me scan. <gasps> oh, man. I guess I should scan, like, the cabinets and stuff, but... I have three grenades, and the game is saving. Holy! Hello, guys. Boom. Double Kido. Daburu Kido. 
Any item found? Okay. I don't know Silent Hill has been done already. Ah, you told me that the other day, right? Silent Hill and Doom. With the fog and everything, or? Let's check this cabinet. Yeah, I'm, st I'm starting to understand the game's logic. <laughs> so there's only this way, right? Okay, we got another scan and another one of those pills. I, I still don't know what those pills are, but... Hit the other guy. Why is he new guy for me, man? <laughs> Bro, this game is... Against me. This game is against me, guys. Uh, what is this map? Okay, so there's a key there. So let's enter this room, then. It'll make a pretty intense hideous map. They shoot back. Boost first stars and stuff. Oh, it only tells you there's a key item. Not that there's any key. Yeah, okay. Let's get this ammo. I yeah, I guess if you had the fog. I mean, it could have like a little bit, at least. So, there's like, the draw distance is not like to the horizon. It's looking like 20, 30 meters, you know? That would be cool, I think. Oh, will you look at that? A car right there, yikes. Who's that door here? I never checked. What the fuck is this guy? Wow. Um, what? Hello? So my grenade didn't do anything. Dancing around. <laughs> These guys like follow me. Yeah, I'm the enemy. Let me see if I can dodge this guy. Ah, oh, too slow. I want to still try it. Oh, we almost... He was attacking, but he got stunned. There you go. Oh, you got it! Good job, bro! GC Doom has full fog shaders. Wonder what suffered Doom did. As if I knew. So let's check this room. We never went this way. Ooh. This kind of looks like the way to go. Uh-oh. Oh! The music in this game is very underwhelming. There is no tension because the music when there is no enemies is the same music that there weren't the, that when there is enemies. So you guys remember? Now that's just nasty. It's not nasty, yeah. It's called pooping, you know? So, there is nothing here? Hmm. I was saying something and I lost my turn of thought. Oops. Oh, shit. Hey, good job, bro. Keep shooting. You got it. Yeah, the music thing. 
Like, if you guys think about Resident Evil 1, 2, or 3, you are like with very cool soundtrack on the background. And then when there's enemies, it's like, tun tun, tun tun, tun tun, tun tun, tun tun, tun tun. You know, it's like, oh shoot. But in this game, nah. Nah. Get fucking knife, bro. Oh! They keep Caroni. Okay, I need ammo game. Like, I have three bullets. <laughs> Is there anything like. Huh? Bro, game? Item found. Where? <laughs> oh, out there. What the fuck? Oh, there's a higher up there. <coughs> Give me that green. Oh. So what is this item? I know this guy is complete, but why can't I not take the fucking item? Is it? Is it on the floor below me? Did you just scan an object in a different floor? I forgot you can shoot the padlocks, basically. I thought I needed a fucking key for that. No! Oh no, no, no. Man. At the beginning of the game, there was a door with a padlock, and the game was like, you can shoot this. But I literally forgot about that mechanic. And I've been coming back and forth all this time. Bro. I hate to put that because in all, all the other rest of games, Padlock, you can open with lockpicks, not by shooting it. That's so stupid. That is so fucking stupid. If you want to put something that you can give an indication that I can break, put like a barricade or put. I don't know. Holy moly, man. Okay, game. I need to remember that, guys, for next time. Holy shit. We've been going around for like 20 minutes. When all I had to do was this. Can I use my knife? Yeah, yeah. Ah, there you go. That's how you progress. Yikes. Okay, another helm. And an elevator. Oh, this is what I need for the for the shotgun. It looks like it. I guess not. Okay then. Good game. That's so stupid. Holy moly. My rant. Uh, choose the floor. Uh, lower cabins. Oh, so we are in this door. Let's see. Door unlocked. A uh, bridge. Here we go, Parker. Wait, Parker didn't get in the elevator. <laughs> Parker did not get in the elevator. A biner. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Parker, should I go back? Let's see. Oh, I cannot. I cannot even go back. Oh, there he is. I'll come back, bro. He called the elevator. Oh shit! Someone was being here.
shotgun shells. I don't have a shotgun. I could have a shotgun, but... I don't know what item I needed. Okay. Here we go. Spooky time. I'm at the bridge. <gasps> Doesn't look like I can use this for communications. Well, someone sabotage the whole bridge. Handgun ammo case. Ammo case increases your ammo capacity. Nice. Nice. Any scanners? Any scanners in chat, guys? Do I need to be close to scan something? I'm not sure. Any scanners in chat? Is that an objective here? Oh. The communication system is down. We can't change our course. We're completely adrift. This is recent. The perpetrator can't be far. Uh oh. Bye bye, boat. That is not going back now. Don't tell me that was the tugboat. Shit. We'll be stuck here. Oh! Dear. Wait, we saw this guy before with O'Brien on the news or something. Please, drop the women. Drop yours, Parker. Who the hell are you? Oh, Parker said. Too late. Episode two, double mystery end. Well, that was a uh, the fastest speed run ever. Thirty-seven minutes. What is that BP thingy? Is that is that coins to buy something? Yeah. <sighs> Next. So every episode has a part with Chris Resident Evil Revelation. and a part with Jill, or how does it work? Is this, is this part part one one part one two and then part two one two two is that how it works then the setup that got jill and parker it was all <laughs> it's a trap yeah i'd almost guarantee it but ryan we'll go after jill and parker make your way to the mediterranean where damn it master took all my weapons can you reach hq no comms are as it seems we'll be stuck here who the hell are you? Oh! Nice movie, bro. You guys enjoying the movie? Should, should I make some popcorns? Episode 3, Ghost of a Veltro. Let's keep going. I don't know. How many episodes has this game? How many episodes are on this game? One year ago, Terra Grigia. Okay, so this was during the attack, and this guy's here. Oh, was this part of the. Oh, it was a part of the good guys. Still hurting, Cadet? Cadet? No. I can still fight. That's the spirit. It's over. The city is finished. Looks like Rebecca. Okay, so we're playing as Parker now. We have a, a freaking Magnum and a MP5, whatever it's called. This is one wake -up call, which was long overdue. Who are you? Never mind, this will look like a wreck. I'm on the character moles are so like. Jessica, <laughs> Parker, come in. The facility has been breached. We're closing shop. Prepare to go home. So we are being attacked. 
Yes, sir. I'm going. I'll cover the hallway with Jessica. Cadet. Oh, this is sure Jessica too. Teleport. So Jessica worked with Chris. They've started evacuation procedures here. And with Parker. Brian? Oh shoot! Oh hunters. There we go, guys. Hell yeah, son of bitches! Kill all enemies in the hole. What the fuck is this guy, bro? To the chopper! Get to the chopper! Nice back I think Stay down, boy. <laughs> what the fuck? Bro, what is this game? <laughs> We're playing Resident Evil, guys. Apparently. A true Resident Evil experience. This you got move away. I don't think there's friendly fire, but ouch. Okay, you gotta taste my pistol now, motherfuckers. How many more do I have to kill? Okay. Right. Now it's our turn to get on that chopper. Get to the chopper. Head to the elevator. Okay, here we go. I followed you, Jessica. I just followed you. Look at her go. Look at that pose. That's true Jill holding weapon. The professional. What is this way, huh? Can we go through here? I guess. What's up, boys? Oh, hello. Boom. One shot. Go, go, go! Sorry to drag you into this. That's fine, but you're buying me dinner next time, and I'm ordering lobster. La, the tone, nice tone. You are in the middle of a. The music in this game is atrocious. Head to the other elevator. Okay, this gun sucks. <laughs> what the fuck? Nice job, Hunter. Good to go. These environments are very bland, too. Oh! Give me this. Aim three. Hell yeah, brother. What's up, boys? Sit. Sit. This action sections is not my thing. I that part with the boat and all the enemies that was been cool and it only lasted like 10 minutes. The suspension, you know? And now we are switching between episodes and between characters and I don't have time to recreate myself on that true reasonable feeling, you know? Um That O'Brien guy. BSAA director? Not my type. 
That's not what I meant. Yeah, I agree. I think being in the FBC distorts your moral compass. All right, where do we go here? Just like it. Still, I wouldn't mind being on the right side of the fight. Ah, uh, game. Okay. Oh. Most obstacles you cannot go through. One obstacle. Oh, you can go through this one. Shotgun time, boys. Oh. Boom. Okay, let's go. Not a fan of these mechanics of this like gameplay in general. Elevator, elevator, where are you? Four, five. Enemy. That was too predictable. Come on, man. Just come out. Don't be shy. No? Oh, it was just a little, a little scare, I guess. Any ammo? Hell yeah, brother. I forgot I have the grenades. I need to use them. I have four grenades. Can that hit me? This is damage to me. I'm not sure if the grenades can damage me. I don't think so because you cannot throw them too far. I have not. Wow. Around the corner, huh? Do you need to say items between chapters? Do they save over the next chapter? Or do you start with like a standard loadout? You know what I mean? Does it matter how well you do? Or do, you, do you have to conserve heals and ammo for the next chapter, or just? Are you kidding me? A dead end? Are you kidding me, though? Oh my god! <laughs> oh, was that Nemesis? Can I open this? We can get through here. Give me a hand. Okay, I'm coming. I don't know, this feels so like hollow. For the love of God. Jessica, hurry. I mean I mean you should both be dead by how close they were, but okay. Look at her face. She cannot stop smiling. She's so happy to be in this situation. You know? <laughs> Oh shit, they're giving us a lot, guys. This is gonna be a big fight. Yeah. Big fight incoming. I just feel the pistol is so, so much worse than any of the other guns I'm carrying that why would you bother using the pistol? If it was like a Magnum that you can like two shot a hunter, sure. But man, you have to shoot them. Yeah, the DPS compared to the other, to the shotgun and the other gun is so low that just not worth it. Damn, come on. Not even close. They're almost here. What's up, boys? I think they're here for you. It's because you're a flirt. Sorry, I don't date cannibal monsters. Wow, why is this humor? Oh shit. Need to reload. No, I didn't notch that by the way. That the game was generous, I guess. Oh, you can do that? You can reload and keep running. I didn't know that.
Yeah, okay. So you can like aim and reload and then he, uh, stop aiming and it will reload too. And the fucking elevator come already. Man, I, should, I need to dodge more, I guess. I don't know how many herbs I have left, but I have, I have used a lot. I'm just gonna stay on this, on this corner. Elevator? Is she kicking him? Why are they jumping so much? Sorry, I'm your comment before Polygon about that guy being on the right side of being on the good guys, you know? Jessica, let's go, Jessica, let's go! Jessica! Bro, what is happening? Grenade! I don't have many herbs. I'm dead. I'm dead. Yeah. Go! <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> Look at me. I have no more heals. Jesus, I thought it was gonna stop again. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Yeah, yeah sure. We are perfect. Leave Morgan decided to fry the city with the solar energy satellite. Raccoon city all over again. Yes. Wiped off the face of the earth. So Morgan is the mayor, right? And he Deragrigia will be just a name in the history book. Elevator? We good? I need a hair, man. Do everything we could, right? I hope we did. Well, just don't forget about that lobster dinner you owe me. <laughs> when have I ever gone back on my work? One hit, I'm undead, guys. No Herbies? We out of here, though. We gotta go. Okay, ladies first. We did it, guys. Easy. No damage run. They left us. Bro, we just, we're just here. Oh, never mind. We're here inside the helicopter. I thought we were, like, <laughs> on the helipod or something. Laser being laser beam. <laughs> Why will that break though? It's triggered a chain reaction. Look, the city. Oh, they're breaking on the okay, okay, I see. The city's so bright. <laughs> they will probably burn your eyes if you look at it, so. It's we are now from the helicopters contacted them. Contacted them. No more. No one cares. Did there was no build up. It was nothing. nothing. Okay. <laughs> Am I supposed to? Who cares? Something. Next.
Okay, I think I'm gonna do one more episode. Episode four is not right. Cadet. Raymond. Oh, Raymond. That's you, isn't it? <laughs> the BSAA. A little too late. What is the FBC doing here? <laughs> answer me, Raymond. I don't have to answer anything. You have no authority over this. There's no time to fight. We've got to give it a rest. I don't even know why you're here or who you're fighting. Raymond, stop right there. Nothing will change unless you get your hands dirty. So the FBC is on this ship too. What's going on here? We're operating without any intel. We need to search this ship for answers. Not that I relish the idea. Okay. So they put all that area before with the car reader and the helm lead and everything, but you cannot solve anything. Okay, again. Any scanners? Uh oh. Hello. Yeah, keep shooting it. Keep shooting it, Parker. Good job. Nice try, bro. Three. It's not working. I just leave it at I'm just leaving that on the map to remember. So now we can carry more ammo. <clears throat> uh, helm a mark. And we got a helm key. How convenient. more custom parts scanning time i wonder if this scan works like kind of resident evil 4 that when you have low resources the enemy drops will be higher i wonder if this game works the same way as in like if the game detects you have no armor or everything then you just scan and items will like spawn to help you or they are predetermined because i am kind of thinking i'm finding less stuff when i have more ammo ship layout for all our staff and crew the queen zenobia is a pleasure cruise liner that provides world class service with the comfort of a luxury hotel for our passengers this ship offers numerous services and facilities for our guests as a representative for this ship is it is your job to be familiar with all the facilities that can be found here the following list outlines some of the major facilities on this ship please read each one carefully Promenade hold. Boasting an area of 1,500 square meters, the ship's promenade uh, hull has three floors and is more spacious than any other ship in the world. The interior has done in a gothic style, with ceilings covered in chandeliers. Its, beautiful, its, its beauty and style rivals that of the finest opera houses. Okay. Casino. The ship's casino can be found next to the prom promenade hall. Promenade? Is that how you say it? All kinds of, of gaming pleasures await our guests, including card games and slot machines. Everything guests you will expect from a casino can be found here 24 hours a day. Restaurants and shops. The promenade hall has designer goods and brand name stores from all over the world. Guests can relax at our many restaurants and bars. There's, there are also shops that cater to our guests every day needs. It's like a high class luxury boat or ship or cruise. Yeah. Emergency communication room. There's an emergency communication room next to the promenade that can be used as a safety point during an emergency. Crew can also use this room to transmit an emergency distress call, distress call should the need arise. Solarium. The shattered glass of the solarium overlooks the world's largest onboard swimming pool. This romantic spot is a, a favorite destination for many of our passengers. Be on the lookout for cables to sneak in after hours. Hmm. Okay. 
So we need a carrier for this. Let's leave that on the on the map. And now that we got this key, let's explore. There is two doors I can open with that key, I think. Potentially three. But it's pretty linear so far. Hell. Hell. Oh, that's where the shotgun is in it. More notes. Uh, this card message. Oh god, please help me. This can't be happening. Don't leave me to die in this cell. I'm trapped here. There's monsters here. Real ones. Everyone's dead or dying. There are no survivors. Shit, we're all gonna die. Okay. Is that not supposed to make me feel unsettled or something? Upper interior map. find an emergency communication room if we go through the hall. Well, that's where the shotgun. More documents. History of the Queen Zenobia. I'm not gonna read all this. George Trevor. That's the architect of the first mansion in the Resident Evil 1. He's the father of uh, Lisa. It's named after Zenobia, the queen of the Palmyrian Empire, who was disposed by the Romans. The beauty of the Atlantic. Oh, we're on the Mediterranean! So it's like an old ship upgraded, I guess. Okay, interesting. Hello? Oh! Wow, so scary. How horrible, must be in a painful death. Nah, he died instantly and then the bugs got him, you yeah. know? Free meat. So that's all there is here. Okay then, I guess we go back. We should go to the emergency communication room. Maybe try to contact HQ. Alright, we got to find Rain. How do you know him? I used to work with him. Let's leave it at that. Alright, so uh, we have to go there. Um, I guess we use this key on the other door. How? So, are they going to eventually explain how this infection works? Let's go lower cabins. Oh, shit. We got in, we're getting some uh, turbulences. Uh, we're in a ship, after all. Alright, so let's go get the shotgun. And then we use the key on the other door. I hope our enemies respawn because otherwise it's gonna be boring. That's a carry there. Oh, hello. Oh, the fuck, you can shoot. Take that, motherfucker. Oh. Well, yeah, brother. So there's a uh, range attack enemies. Yeah, they're very squishy. 
Evay Squishy. So let's keep going for the shotgun. Where was the other door for this key? I forgot to be honest. And this game is really lacking atmosphere, soundtrack, everything. I believe the shotgun was in this room. There's the crest. Hell yeah, brother. Windham. Oh, hello. Not today. Man. Go, go, go. That door there. So we got doors that can be open. It says there, man. <laughs> doors that can be open as in like I could have opened it before. Uh painful. So what's that door? One that I can open with this key. I think it is. This is the elevator. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, for sure. The elevator was there. This one. Yeah. So what's in here? Hello? Someone in there? If an enemy comes out, I'm gonna be pissed. More notes. Note found in room 303. What the hell is going on? Monsters are crawling all over the ship. They are tearing it to pieces. I've never seen monsters like this. Their movements are stiff, stilt, but it's all over if they get a hold of you. Those pieces of shit monsters ate my friend Hassan. Bastards! I used my gun to frighten them off, giving me time to get the hell out of here. The bullet went straight through its arm. Thank God, these monsters have bones like an old woman. Uh, there is nowhere left to run now. That monster twisted my leg good. Hell, I have run out of ammo too. God only knows how I'm going to survive this. Nice. Cool note. Illegal custom parts. Why are they illegal? <laughs> so, the whole point of coming here is to read that note. And to get those weapon parts. Okay. So, we were on the upper deck and then we went to the lower deck. I think we had to go to the middle deck? Bridge or lower cabins? Maybe not. Bro. Get inside, man. <laughs> oh no, I didn't mean to do this. Oops. Okay. But how do I make it over there? Bro, this map, holy shit. That door. This is the cafeteria. So I have to go through there. Okay. I think we have to go to, through the upper cabins. Yeah. And then we go through the big corridor here. What is the cafeteria though?
over the rainbow. No, no, no. So, wait, 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 wait. What? I'm so confused. Oh, wait, there's a helm locked in this room? The one downstairs a helm locked? What is the, is the key that is the... That one? Oh, maybe I can open that one. I thought it was a different key. My bad. It's definitely not this one. This one is the anchor. But this one? Oh, I could open this. Okay. It's okay, though. We... We check all around. <clears throat> okay. Here we go. First time here. I have a shotgun now. Holy shit. Oh! We're in the Titanic. Welcome to the Titanic, guys. Now, this is what I call a cruise ship. It's like an opera house in here. Well, we'll see, bro. Should I explore a little bit? Nah. I think they're gonna make us go all around the ship, no matter what, so we're gonna just go to objective. We have weapon parts. So let's see. Uh, fire power 20%. Fire rate. <clears throat> let's do... We're going to be shooting more with a pistol. So I'm thinking we put this one back. And then we we'll get the shotgun. This one. E. <clears throat> right. Stop only. A life boy, Mark. Dude, posted a note here. A note. Note left in front of the emergency communications room. Welcome to the Titanic, where the icebergs are undead. <laughs> oh no. PTSD. The icebergs are the zombies. This is emergency communication route. No one, no one gets in without my permission, and not without my key. If you want in, come find me at my usual spot on the promade deck. Your comms officer. There's a message scroll underneath. This is scrap. This is crap. This shit is crawling with freaks and monsters. I'm going to the promenade because at least I can find food there. Anyone who's still alive can meet me up there do you know where to find me i'm not going out like that i can promise you that i hope uh, i'm not the only survivor your friendly neighborhood comms officer okay okay bro so that one is downstairs downstairs look at this clock the clock is high as the ceiling. Look at this shit. Holy. Is this screenshot why? Is this screenshot worth? I mean. <coughs> why they the why they had to do G, my my girl G like this? Parker, please and come close. Thank you. <laughs> So there is an elevator here. I'm just checking around, you know. There's another door locked. Casino. An anchor. Another door here. Man, I already hate how the camera keeps looking up on its own. And so this one is open. 
I'll, eh, I'm starting to like this exploration. It's like it felt very small at the beginning. But now we are uh, entering bigger areas. And they're letting us explore a little bit more. The shutter's down. I can see that. I hear like monsters behind. Parker, can you help me? No? Yeah. <laughs> well, we kind of go that way. So, we go this way. Or it sounds like the ganados, it's not like the, like the, the, the plagas. Sounds like a cult. Is this rifle ammo? Yeah. Hello? Oh shit. Looks like we found the promenade. Oh, you can shoot the projectile me there. There is an explosive tank there. I just feel the combat has no weight. I don't know, it's weird. Three... I need to scan the enemies before I kill them. There's monsters hiding behind every corner. We have yet to find one survivor. Who the fuck is singing, bro? And who pulled all these gas tanks around? <laughs> oh, we can go that way, but we cannot come back afterwards, so... Let me explore... This first. A custom part. Any scanners? Lock from the other side. Okay. That looks like the li life boot. Life boat? Whatever you call it. Oh, let's just go this way, I guess. <laughs> Here we go. Mayday. This is the Queen Zenobia. Emergency call number. Mayday. Holy moly. Bro, I dodged that. Grenade! I think this creature might be the comms officer. Can I get through? I'm just leaving I'm just leaving Parker there. I don't want to deal with that enemy in that small rook. What the fuck is that? I don't know man. You tell me. <laughs> he has a fucking, uh, like a saw for a hand. I feel like I should have my. Oh. Holy shit! Wait, I, I was gonna say, like, I didn't die by that. You are dead. Kremlings. Um, yeah, I feel like I don't have enough firepower. And I feel, um... I should have a, um... I should have a rifle right now. Let's go, I'm gonna... Can I go back, even? I think I can. Let me try to go find the rifle because they're giving me a lot of fucking rifle ammo. And I don't have a rifle. 
And the rifle does a lot of damage. I think the rifle do does more than the shotgun. So if I find the sh if I find the rifle, that'll be very useful. But where? <laughs> Let's go back here. Let's explore. Man, it would be really weird. It's not in that area, but I check everything and I didn't see it. Maybe it's on the main hole. Let's see. Let's look around here. Some custom parts. Nice. So this door is closed. Let's look around. Oh, eyes open. Eyes open. Nice looking ship. Will be nice without all the monsters. No shit. There is uh, an. It's not working. An elevator. What is this? <clears throat> None of the elevators are working. Okay, let's check the third floor. Even though something tells me. It's gonna be the same. Mm. Let's go over here. It's open for a reason, right? I was like, no, nah, the game is not gonna. Yeah, sure. This elevator does work. Oh, never mind. It show it was blue. The fuck. <clears throat> there is another door here. Solarium, but this is gonna be close, isn't it? Oh no, it's open. But why would you make me come here if the objective is down below? This makes no sense, though. This makes no sense. If you're... If you're pointing me... Downstairs. And put a lot of fucking... Sh Holy shit, look at this place. And put a lot of rifle ammo. Why would you put the rifle here? Holy moly. This is the pool. They were talking about the pool. Very romantic indeed. Inventory full. So I have these five pills. Does that mean I have like extra heals or something? I don't know. They'll put the dad in a home, another straw was detected. Oof. I don't know where I'm going. Do I have a screwdriver still? I do. A puzzle time. Let's see. Oh, this one is a lot harder. Ah, uh, uh, wait, wait, wait. This one. There you go. But I do it. I did it right. Wait, what? No, I had it. Why didn't it solve? Oh, because this one has to be here. Okay. Oops. 
Oopsies. Uh, give me a rifle, game. Give me a rifle. I don't want custom parts. Oh! Bro, that's so troll. That is so troll. That is so troll. Wow. You put the rifle all the way up here. I'll be able to purify the pool with the pool with this. Activate, yes. Here we go. Why will you put an objective downstairs and then put the rifle up here? Wait, did I purify the pool? I'm not sure if I click yes or no. Yeah, I clicked yes. Okay. Anything gonna happen? Gonna take a while. Known. Come back later. <laughs> yeah. What kind of filtration system have you set on your pool that's gonna clean all this fucking shit? Like, what the fuck? I want to buy that filtration, man. There is no way I'm getting in that. True. Uh, let's go back to kill that big motherfucker. Now, I got the firepower. That is really bad design, to be honest. To put the rifle up here. <laughs> the best laser filter grid. Yeah, the, the pull... Uh, the operation well works with, with a laser. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go back to... The, that guy the the com the comms officer whatever his name is <sighs> that is so lame so i wonder if you can actually beat him with the ammo i had instead of killing normal enemies if, you, if i just just focus on him i wonder if, we, if i could have killed him but at the same time I didn't know the enemies were going to respawn forever. Like, they just keep coming and coming and coming. Through the ventilation. Seeing the laser fly supper? I haven't seen that. What is that? Yeah, no. Right, here we go. I really hope uh, we can kill it now. We have a lot. Oh, it's, it was not this way. No, it was this way. I have a lot of... I think I have actually maximum ammo. Yeah. Okay, we got this now. No damage run. Speed running. Let's put some modifications on the rifle. Long magazine, fire rates. Let's see. Okay, here we go. I have a stupid idea. Watch it and you will understand. A laser flies up. Okay. Trying to imagine that like what, what could that be? Emergency call number. Okay, let's go over here. Kill this guy. Oh, that's a lot. That's... Yeah, that does a lot more damage, huh? What is he doing? Oh, shit. Does he get attracted by that? Oh, 
run. No, oh, he almost got me there. Tasty. So, according to the achievement I just got, he will have killed me there. And I dodged his attack. You go, Parker. You got this, man. Okay, I'm just gonna abuse the the loop. I'm just gonna loop this guy. I missed. Should I shoot? Which head should I shoot? That one or the other one? Don't hit me through the window, please. Look at that booty! <laughs> I shoot whatever has a face. I like that. Like, look at those guys coming out. You're not human. Don't deal! Tasty. Itchy tasty. Come on, man. Just die. Time to scan. Bro, how tank is this guy? Hello? Wow. The thing refuses to die! He does. Oh, wow, wow, wow. He doesn't... He barely gives you time to, like... Oh, shit. Oh well, I had to kill this guy. Oh my god, if I can travel you kill me. Come on, Parker, man! Wow. Should I shoot the saw? He's dead. Yeah, he's dead. We got him, boys. I just have to kill all these clips. Oh, let me scan you guys. Fucking hell. I don't have any flames, I don't have anything. No grand runs or anything. <laughs> oh, we got him. It's okay. He dropped the life book key. Is that the key to the emergency communication room? Yeah. Leave this monster infested hell you got it. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> it's playing dead, it's gonna revive. Are you shooting me, bro? We got it. That was a tanky boss. Hard boss. Holy shit. We gotta open this now. It was a... Pistol ammo, please. Shotgun ammo case. Oh! Not easy, not fun? That was, that's true, that's true. If it was too easy, it will not be fun. I like that, but I didn't like that I needed a rifle for it, though. Because especially where... Where they place the... Where they place the... The rifle? That's bullshit.
All right, so let, let, let me go back for a second. Get the <clears throat> get the green herb. Oh, the green herb and the piece of ammo from back there, and then we'll continue through that door that we just got the key for. Oh, this is open now. It says exit and it's open, but okay. Also, we got some couple of weapon parts. Never mind. I thought we got one. <clears throat> okay. So there was a herb here. And then there was some ammo here. How many herbs do I have now? Two. We have two herbs. Wasn't there pre I thought there was pistol lava there. <clears throat> Herp? You got herb beast. Uh, how are we doing on ammo? We have Oh we're okay. We are okay in ammo. <clears throat> Can I go this way? Nope. What do you mean by turrets? Torreta. Right, let's go this way. I didn't explode these two barrels. Oops. Oh, there's more ammo there. Nice. Let me do a quick scan before we go. Ah, right, here we go. Trash. Elevator. Oh, puzzle time. Are they gonna change up the puzzles, or is it always gonna be this one? I think it's always gonna be the same puzzle. Do, 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 do. Boop, boop. So where do we have to go now? We got the communications key or the lifeboat thingy to access the. I don't want to go to the deck. Wait. I don't want to go here though. But let's let's go here to like explore. You know. Too far to scan. Ooh, we got a handprint. Another key card required there. We got. Wow, well, that was a waste. That was a waste. There is a lot of ammo here. Yeah, because I. Those boxes are good. If you are missing ammo, the game will give you like 20, 30 bullets. But if you are is almost full, it will be like five bullets, you know. So I'm not gonna pick. I'll pick it up. Like three ammo. Right, we still need the car reader for that, and the car reader for this. I'm just gonna interact so it appears in the map. It may all already appear. It doesn't appear yet. So I will rather interact and keep track on the map with. That's a very naughty handprints. Indeed. Oh, right, then let's go back. There we go. I feel like I'm playing a Tomb Raider or something. Okay, new door, new area. Oh shit. Raven. Looks like we both were too late. What are you talking about? Huh. Ignorant creatures who do not yet know of us. The time both of you. Has come. Look. Thou wilt be I removed. <laughs> the desperate greed drains my heart. 
little masked friend. But if my words be seed that may bear fruit of infamy to the traitor whom I know, speaking and weeping shall thou see together. I know not who thou art, nor by what mode thou hast come down here. <laughs> the world is in our hands. This is the tea of this virus, and we are equipped to infect one fifth of the Earth's waters. T abyss. That's the thing, same thing they throw on, on Terragia because it was like planes throwing like the red shit. And it's the same thing Jill found on the blobs on the shore. He's turning guppies in a jaw. Quiet. And even a child could guess what will happen next. Oh shit! We are felt. Isn't this the mayor from the city? So this is our man. Or is it a different one? I knew it was Veltro. Abandon hope all ye who enter here. I guess not. It looks very similar to him. He's quoting Dante. Send a team to Valcoin and Mock Airport. Look for something linked to this ship, O'Brien. Yes, I read you. I'll send Quint and Keith. What? You two. Get ready to move. I hate snow. Snow hates you. Just find out anything you can on Veltro. But these dialogues is holy shit. And the characters' behavior? Wow. They're behaving like five years old. I don't see a thing. Is Jessica? I thought the Mediterranean was just and like Chris. a big lake. Be patient. Finding a ship at sea is like finding a needle in a haystack. No kidding. But that still doesn't solve our problem. Hey, are you even listening? We'll find you, Jill. I promise. Oh! Chris! They're coming for us. Well, that was the end of the episode 3. I'm kind of tired, but I want to do one more. Nah, I'm gonna call it now. 53 minutes, holy shit, man. And two beds. Ooh, we got the new pistol unlocked. Raid mode stages 4 to 7 unlocked. Okay. I think there is like a chapter episode 1 to 3. <clears throat> it's like a, a whole episode. Let's see. Or episode 1 to 3. Are you sure you want to quit? You'll lose progress if you don't save your save data. No. Well, let's save then. Okay. Oh. Okay. Well, that was uh, Resident Evil Revelations. Episodes 1, 2, and 3. I'll continue tomorrow. I guess I'll do three episodes each stream. It's a good length. It took us three hours. So, yeah. I was, eh, to be honest, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna review the game yet. I'm not gonna say anything, but not very good impressions. No, no music, no scary enemies, no scary. Like the location of the ship was cool when I was along with Jill, with the flashlight and the corridors. Like that that part, but that was like ten minutes. And then there was a lot of action and exploration. It's kind of eh. The boat looks cool though, now that there is like opening up and there is a lot of areas and floors and a lot of keys and everything. Okay, I see potential, but the character, the dialogues, everything is mediocre and Chris is cool and Jill is, I don't like her model, but, or her voice actor, actress, but eh, she's Jill after all. But yeah. 
Cool. Have a good night, you too, guys. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you tomorrow with more revelations. Bye-bye.